In chapter 8, Luke gives us these pictures of human suffering. The first is on the Sea of Galilee. Jesus and his closest friends are out in a boat when suddenly a storm kicks off. Now Jesus is asleep, but they say that as the wind swoops down the sides of the mountains, that it can create waves up to 20 feet high. This must have been some storm. The disciples, many of whom are fishermen, are petrified. They wake Jesus in a panic. Jesus wakes up. He rebukes the storm and there is peace. In the very next scene, Jesus comes to shore with his disciples and they are met by a man who is unkept, who is naked, who hangs around tombstones, who is demon possessed. Now my initial reaction would be to get back into the boat and sail around the corner. But Jesus sees the suffering this man is enduring and he frees him of this demonic activity. This man suddenly becomes a picture of peace. As the town folk come along, they discover him there at Jesus' feet in sound mind and fully dressed. A picture of peace. So this is my wetsuit. I love going surfing and I've surfed some pretty cold waters over the years. I even surfed the Shetlands where it was freezing cold. But generally the wetsuit protects me from the cold. When it comes to following Jesus, life will not always be easy. Faith in God isn't some kind of wetsuit against suffering. There will be tough times. There will be times when we experience storms, financial hardship, relationship difficulties. And sometimes we'll question, why God do you allow this to take place? There'll be other times when we experience very tangibly the powers of evil, discrimination, injustice, racism. And we're called to tackle these things, but often that will be at a cost. And sometimes when we pray, God will intervene miraculously we'll see incredible things take place. But there'll be other times when the miraculous isn't always so evident, when perhaps the only miracle is that God gives us a peace within to keep persevering even when times are tough. Today, may God, by his Holy Spirit, give you a sense of peace in the very depth of your being. Peace be with you.